Once there was a colony of snails. The snails found a really good place to live by a small stream underneath an old broken bridge. They could drink the water from the nearby stream, and there were lots of tasty plants for the snails to eat. There were flowers, mushrooms, berries, and there were many other plants with lots of tasty leaves. No one used the broken bridge anymore, and so the snails had this perfect spot all to themselves. But there was one little problem. There were mountains nearby, and every time it rained in the mountains, a flood of water came rushing through. The water washed the snails down the stream. When they saw the water coming, they tried to climb up on the broken bridge, but they could never make it in time. Then they would have to spend the next three days walking all the way back home. This would happen over and over again. Every time the flood comes, we keep getting washed away. What can we do? One of the snails had an idea. We can't see very far up the stream, and we can't hear the water until it's too late. The snail said, "So." Why don't we build a tall watchtower and put a watchman on top? If we had a watchman up on the watchtower, he would be able to see further up the stream. If a flood was coming, he would see it when it was still far away, and he could warn us in time. The other snails liked the idea. Let's try it, they said. They all worked together to build a tall watchtower. The watchtower was tall enough to see over all the plants and trees, and they made a place at the top for the watchman to stand. They also made a flagpole at the top. If there was no flood coming, the watchman would leave the white flag up. But if there was a flood coming, the watchman would raise the red flag. If the snails ever saw the red flag, they knew it was time to climb higher. The white flag stayed up for a long time, and the snails were happy. They enjoyed the tasty plants. They drank water from the stream. And they took naps when they were tired. But one day, they saw the red flag go up. They looked around to see if a flood was coming. But they didn't see any water coming, and they didn't hear any water coming. It seems like it's safe, one of the snails said. Don't forget, said another snail, the watchman can see farther than we can. The red flag is up, so there must be danger coming. We have to trust the watchman. Let's climb up the bridge. All of the snails started to climb up the bridge. Right when all the snails got to safety, lots of water came rushing through the camp. But none of the snails were washed away. They listened to the watchman, 
and they were able to get to safety in time. Did you know that when the Lord calls a prophet, the Lord's prophet is kind of like a watchman? The Lord helps the prophet to see farther than we can. And then the prophet can warn us when there is spiritual danger coming, just like the watchman. If we trust the Lord's prophets and listen to their warnings, we can be protected from the things that will harm us. We can be safe from the spiritual dangers of the world. I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore, hear the word at my mouth, and give them warning from me. Want to download Latter-day Kids videos to your device to watch offline? The easiest way is with the Living Scriptures streaming app. Try Living Scriptures free for 60 days by going to livingscriptures.com ldk.